Serving much more than just shopping destinations, these malls are designed to be self-contained cities. Join me, I'm counting down 15 largest shopping malls in the world. Starting with number 15, the Persian Gulf Complex, Iran. The Persian Gulf Complex in the city of Shiraz in Iran is a huge building that's not just a shopping mall, but an integrated commercial, entertainment, and cultural complex that's become a focal point of life there. Covering more than 4.8 million square feet, it opened in 2011 and has been designed with the vision of creating a space that caters to a wide array of needs and desires, ranging from shopping and dining to entertainment and leisure. The complex has more than 2,500 retail outlets, offering a blend of international brands and local craftsmanship, along with entertainment options such as an indoor amusement park, complete with thrilling rides and games. There's also a vast food court with a selection of cuisines from around the world to cater to every taste, making it a truly international destination. It also contains a 262-room hotel, a bowling alley, a three-story billiard hall, and a number of cultural spaces such as galleries and exhibition halls. This venue hosts a variety of events from art exhibits and cultural showcases to conferences and business meetings. Number 14, SM Seaside City, Philippines. SM Seaside City, which is in Cebu City in the Philippines, opened in November of 2015 as part of SM Prime's holdings portfolio of world-class malls. With stunning architecture, a diverse retail offerings, and plenty of leisure, SM Seaside City has quickly become a landmark and a central hub for both locals and tourists. The mall's design features a circular layout that makes it easier to find your way around the stores, dining outlets, and entertainment facilities. The structure is unique. Its architectural style maximizes scenic views of the surrounding landscape, but also serves to enhance its environmental sustainability, making it a model of modern eco-friendly design. With a floor area of more than 5 million square feet, this place is home to hundreds of stores ranging from local favorites to international brands, making it a shopper's paradise. And with a large department store, supermarkets, and various specialty stores, you'll find virtually everything you could possibly want there. Dining is also a particular highlight at the mall, with a wide range of options available, from fast food chains to gourmet restaurants. Designed to be a place you'll spend your day in, it also features plenty of entertainment and leisure facilities, from a cinema complex that includes the largest IMAX theater in the world, to an ice skating rink and a bowling center. For families, the mall also provides a rooftop garden that offers panoramic views of the city and the sea, a children's playground, and interactive installations, making it an ideal destination for family outings. Number 13, Global Harbor, China. Global Harbor, which is in central Shanghai in China, first opened in 2013, and it remains one of the largest in the city, presenting a unique blend of retail, culture, and leisure under one roof. The exterior has an elegant and intricate design, featuring a blend of traditional European elements with modern architectural techniques. The mall's facade is decorated with classical European sculptures and detailing, combined with the use of glass and steel to create a visually stunning effect. Inside, though, is where it really comes into its own. Global Harbor offers unparalleled shopping experiences, with a floor area of over 5 million square feet. It's spread across six floors, it's got a wide range of stores that cater to the varied tastes and preferences of shoppers, and the interior design continues the theme of blending cultures with spacious, light-filled atriums and themed areas. The food court, too, offers more choices than you'll know what to do with, from traditional Chinese dishes to cuisine from every corner of the globe. Above the mall are twin skyscrapers, offering residential and commercial space. And with the mall alongside the stores, there's a huge cinema complex, an indoor amusement park, and various cultural and artistic spaces. It's now a destination in its own right. Global Harbor places a strong emphasis on convenience and accessibility, with excellent transport links that make it easily reachable from any part of Shanghai. Its location and the variety of services it offers makes it popular for not only shopping, but for experiencing the vibrancy and diversity of Shanghai as a whole. But even with all this, it's not even close to being the biggest in the country. Number 12, SM North, Philippines. SM City North, EDSA, which is in Quezon City, the most populated city in the Philippines, is an enormous shopping complex that's established itself as a central hub for retail, entertainment, and leisure. Since its opening in 1985, it's continued to evolve and expand, keeping it consistently as one of the largest in the country. Spanning over 5.3 million square feet, the mall's almost a thousand different stores, making it a convenient one-stop shop. 
As well as that shopping, SM North EDSA is also a haven for entertainment and leisure. There are several different cinemas, including IMAX theaters, where moviegoers can enjoy the latest blockbuster films. And as you'd expect, it also has a variety of dining options. Food courts offer an array of local delicacies and international dishes, giving you plenty of chances to regain your energy before visiting more stores. This is a serene place of calm amidst the bustling city, offering greenery, an artificial river, waterfalls, walking paths, and seating areas where visitors can relax and unwind. Within the garden is also a 1,500-seat entertainment venue that regularly hosts performances, which allows them all to offer a little more than its competitors. Number 11, One Utama, Malaysia. With 713 stores, One Utama in Selangor, Malaysia is a sprawling shopping complex with more than 5.5 million square feet of floor space, making it one of the largest in the country. Its size is hard to comprehend, housing an extensive selection of retail outlets, dining establishment, and entertainment and recreational areas. Architecturally, it blends contemporary elements with traditional Malaysian designs. Its sleek facade and interior layout give a sense of elegance and sophistication, with spacious corridors decorated with artistic installations and lush greenery that create a welcoming atmosphere from the moment you walk in. To set it out from the rest, the owners of the mall ensure that there are facilities on offer that you'll rarely find anywhere else, including a bowling alley, a baseball cage, a climbing wall, a surfing pool, an indoor skiving wind tunnel, and even its very own indoor rainforest with more than 200 different plant species. All of this attracts as many as 33 million people a year, with the holiday seasons being particularly busy, and to accommodate such footfall, it's got 14,000 parking spaces and has a transport station right next to it. Number 10, Mall of America, Minnesota. Currently holding the record for not only being the largest shopping mall in the United States, but in the whole of the Western Hemisphere, the Mall of America, which is in Bloomington, Minnesota, first opened in 1992, and it offers more than 5.6 million square feet of floor space. Set around a rectangular design, about half the area is dedicated to more than 500 retail units across three floors, and the rest is taken up by a wide range of different entertainment offerings. With soaring ceilings, expansive atriums, and enticing interior layouts, there's a sense throughout of its size. The bright and airy corridors encourage you to keep walking around, but shopping is just the beginning here. There are, of course, extensive dining choices available too, but this is also where you'll find the Nickelodeon Universe theme park with several roller coasters, a miniature golf course, an indoor zip line, and the Sea Life Minnesota Aquarium. There's so much to do there that you can easily spend an entire day at the mall without even scratching the surface, and that's why people keep going back. Amazingly, it attracts more than 42 million people per year, which is around eight times the entire population of Minnesota, with most either being local residents or traveling from Wisconsin, Iowa, Nebraska, the Dakotas, and Ohio. With such a huge footfall, it's also one of the most important employers in the state, with around 11,000 workers all year, and up to 13,000 during peak periods. Number 9. Icon Siam, Thailand Built on the banks of a river in Bangkok, Thailand, Icon Siam is a huge mixed-use development that integrates shopping, dining, entertainment, and cultural attractions. Its bold architectural design stands out with sleek lines and curious structures that can be seen from across the city, and includes the tallest structure in Thailand, which is a residential tower. The lower floors, though, are taken up by the Icon Siam Shopping Mall, which features more than 500 retail outlets across its 5.6 million square feet. With luxury boutiques, international brands, and local outlets, there's something here for everyone. Food, too, is in plentiful supply with at least 100 restaurants. A huge amount of effort has been put into this site to make it a must-visit destination. Entertainment was at the forefront of this design, with a wide range of attractions and activities to captivate visitors of all ages. The highlight is the multimedia water feature known as the Siam Paragon Digital Screen, which spans over 1,300 feet along the riverfront, and it's used for dazzling light shows, choreographed performances, and immersive experiences. Probably most importantly, though, Icon Siam celebrates Thailand's rich cultural heritage through various exhibitions and showcases. The Multimedia Museum takes visitors on a journey through Thai history, art, culture, using cutting-edge technology and interactive displays. The mall may attract the wealthiest of society, but puts on plenty for everyone, making it a true hub for the wider community. Number 8. Central West Gate, Thailand All right, staying in Thailand opened in 2015. Central West Gate is in Nantanburi, and it's built along the busy Bangyai intersection. 
With more than 5.9 million square feet of floor space, it's one of the largest of its kind in Thailand with a huge range of retail outlets. It's known for its sleek and contemporary design with expansive atriums and stylish architecture. It's easy to get wrapped up in everything that's on offer here. At the heart of the Westgate is the large shopping area, which houses a wide selection of stores catering to every taste and preference, including an enormous IKEA that by itself has 541,000 square feet of space. Also, with the usual selection of food options, there's an indoor amusement park, a 12-screen cinema, and a wider entertainment zone. There's also a gym and spa facilities and several exhibition spaces. From art shows and fashion festivals to music concerts and food fairs, there's always something happening within the mall, which keeps people coming back for more. Moving on to number 7, Golden Resources Mall, China. The Golden Resources Mall in Beijing, China shows all you need to know about modern Chinese consumerism. With its unbelievable size, wide offerings, and unique architecture, it's become a landmark destination for both locals and tourists. And at one and a half times the size of the Mall of America, it opened in 2004, and it held a record for being the largest in the world for a year. With around 6 million square feet of floor space, over six floors, it took a while for it to become the popular place that it is today. Originally expected to welcome over 50,000 people a day, there were some times when there'd barely be 20 people going into the mall in an hour, and this led to a serious amount of subsequent development of transport links to try to turn things around. The mall now has a station that serves two subway lines and a much greater parking capacity. These, along with offering more than a thousand stores, the way that Beijing expanded around it, and the wider economic improvement of the country have now meant that the mall is going from strength to strength. The design of the mall is impressive. Inside, it features spacious corridors, soaring atriums, and innovative interior layouts that create an immersive environment for visitors. Artistic installations, modern amenities, and cutting-edge technology further enhance this experience. After filling up your bags, there's a cinema complex too, and plenty of places to keep the kids entertained with arcade centers and children play areas. Far from simply a shopping destination, it's now a cultural and lifestyle hub that attracts people from all over the city. Number 6. SM Mall of Asia, Philippines The enormous SM Mall of Asia, also known as the MOA, is the largest mall in the Philippines, and it's located in the city of Pasay, which is just to the south of Manila. Virtually a city in its own right, the venue covers an area of 6.3 million square feet across which you'll find 663 stores, including 217 places to eat. This, of course, provides a huge range of different products and cuisines, with it being the go-to place in the area for any shopping needs, from the latest fashion trends and accessories to electronics, home furnishings, and beyond. Its anchor department stores and specialty retailers offer a great selection of goods here. As is common with large malls like this, though, the shops are just the beginning of what's on offer, and the MOA takes things to a whole different level. There is, for example, a huge 20,000-square-foot game park, complete with bowling, arcade, billiards, a sports bar, and various sporting facilities. There's also an Olympic-sized skating rink, a huge cinema, and a dome-shaped museum that's dedicated to the history of the Manila Galleon trade system. The architectural design of it is interesting too, and while the exterior may not look wildly impressive, the interiors take inspiration from the country's rich maritime heritage, especially as you walk out onto the wonderful waterfront promenade. Number 5. South China Mall, China This mall is an interesting example of how even with grand ambitions, there's more to building a successful shopping destination than simply creating a large building and there were huge concerns at first that it would become a complete failure. Located in Dongguan, China, it was designed to be the largest shopping mall in the world, and at an estimated cost of $1.3 billion, this is a record it held for a while after being completed in 2005. Across the venue, there's 7.1 million square feet of space, but for more than 10 years, most of it remained empty. This led to reports of it being called a dead mall, as no merchants wanted to lease space in it because of its deterioration and continuing low footfall. In one last attempt to sort it out, a huge renovation project began in 2015, and this now has attracted far more businesses and people. Those who do go there are in for a surprise, along with space for more than 2,300 stores, most of which are now filled. This isn't a mall like any other. In fact, it's part of a shopping center and themed venue. 
There are, for example, recreations of Amsterdam, Paris, Rome, Venice, Egypt, the Caribbean, and California inside there, with landmark features such as an 82-foot replica of the Arc de Triomphe from Paris, a replica of St. Mark's Bell Tower from Venice, and a 1.3-mile canal that you can ride along in a gondola. Also, featuring a marine park called Sea Cube and hosting various events like temporary night markets, the owners have miraculously managed to turn a place where 99% of the stores were vacant in 2008 to one where only 2 or 3% are available to lease. Number 4. Isfahan City Center, Iran With a rich history of huge structures being built in the country throughout history, it's perhaps no surprise that Iran is home to some of the largest malls in the world. The second biggest in the country is called the Isfahan Center, and it's located in the city of Isfahan, which is around 273 miles from the south of Tehran. One of the largest commercial, cultural, and recreational developments in Iran, its design was intended to represent the rich heritage and the ambitious future of Isfahan, which is a city that's known for its beautiful Islamic architecture. The Isfahan City Center project, which began in the early 2000s, was a multifaceted development aimed to meet a wide array of needs, including shopping, entertainment, residential, office, hotel, and cultural spaces, covering an area of over 8.3 million square feet. It's primarily a commercial hub, but also a cultural and social venue. At the heart of it is a massive shopping mall which houses more than 700 retail outlets, ranging from international brands to local crafts. The mall's design pays homage to the Isfahan's architectural legacy, implementing elements such as dome ceilings, intricate tile work, and expansive courtyards. It features a five-star hotel that provides luxurious accommodations and services to tourists and business travelers. This hotel is designed to reflect the highest standards of hospitality. The city center also provides cultural and recreational activities. It's got an international financial center, a cultural center, and museums that showcase the history and art of the region. Those facilities have become instrumental in promoting its rich heritage and serve as venues for various events. As typical with modern malls, the complex also includes a vast entertainment area, which features a cinema, family entertainment center, and various dining options. And this means they'll go to the mall even if they aren't looking to buy anything. The development of Isfahan City Center has significant impact on the local economy, boosting tourism, creating numerous job opportunities, and as well as becoming a symbol of Isfahan's progress and development. It's proven that if you build a huge development like this in the right place, it can more than justify the cost. Number 3. The IOI City Mall, Malaysia Malaysia has a number of huge malls to cater to the needs of its population, but by far the largest is the IOI City Mall, which is in the city of Putrajaya, which is the country's administrative and judicial capital. It was opened in November of 2014 as part of a larger IOI resort city, which is well-planned and sophisticated. That includes hospitality, leisure, and residential components, blending in seamlessly to the green, well-manicured landscapes of Putrajaya. Covering an area of 8.8 .8 million square feet, IOI City Mall is almost unbelievable in size. It hosts well over 350 retail outlets that offer a wide range of products, and throughout the mall's architecture and interior design reflect contemporary aesthetics, providing a comfortable and inviting atmosphere for visitors. One of the most popular parts of the mall is its extensive array of dining options, again, offering virtually anything you can think of. You could take a culinary tour of the world without leaving the building, with it often described as offering the most food choices of any site in the world. IOI City Mall, as you'd expect, offers far more than just shopping and food, though. It's also a premier entertainment destination. The theme park is designed with a post-apocalyptic theme. It's strange and unique contrast to the rest of the shopping center. Then the mall also has an Olympic-sized ice skating rink, which offers a cool escape from Malaysia's tropical climate, and hosts public skating sessions, ice hockey matches, figure skating classes, and plenty more. Surprisingly, despite its size and dedication to extravagance, the mall has strong commitment to sustainability. Throughout the building, there's an innovative green technology and practices, such as energy-efficient lighting and water-saving fixtures, all of which makes it one of the most environmentally friendly shopping malls per square foot. Since opening, it's had a major impact on the economical development of Putrajaya. Despite initially linked with harming local stores, it's now seen as a vital part of the community, offering employment opportunities, supporting local businesses, and providing space for cultural and social gatherings. Number 2. The Avenues Mall, Kuwait 
The Avenues Mall, which can be found in Al Rai, Kuwait, is an almost unbelievable retail and entertainment space that sprawls across an immense area to offer unique and luxurious shopping experiences. Designed with inspiration drawn from natural elements and traditional Arabic motifs, the Avenues Mall features distinct zones, each with its unique theme and ambiance. These include First Avenue, Second Avenue, the Souk, and the Prestige. When with these categories of stores arranged together, it means it's far easier to navigate the place to find what you're looking for. With an area of almost 13 million square feet, there's more than 1,400 stores that include a mix of high-end luxury brands, international chains, and local boutiques ensuring that every visitor finds something to suit their style and budget. With at least 17,000 parking spaces on site, the mall is much more than a shopping destination. Whether it's saving a gourmet meal or grabbing a quick bite, the mall provides an extensive selection that satisfied everybody. Entertainment was also important in the design phase here, and this mall, while not as full of options as others, has an 11-screen IMAX cinema and several arcades and indoor play areas that will keep the family busy when you're shopping. It's also known for its commitment to sustainability and community engagement, incorporating green spaces and features designed to conserve energy and water. It regularly hosts events and activities that foster community spirit and cultural exchange. The economic impact of the Avenues Mall on Kuwait has been transformational, creating 30,000 jobs for the local economy and attracting international investments. It's become a landmark for tourists and a source of pride for locals. And with so many future developments in the planning stage, who knows what it'll be like in a decade or so. Number 1. The Iran Mall By far, the largest mall in the world in a contest that isn't even close is the Iran Mall in the country's capital city of Tehran. With an area of almost 21 million square feet, it officially opened in phases starting from 2018 and is projected to be even bigger once it's finally finished. Reflecting the multifaceted approach to modern retail spaces that are seen in all the large malls around the world, it too blends shopping with cultural, recreational, and social functions. With one of the largest parking lots in the world offering more than 20,000 spaces, it covers an area that rivals small cities, and it's been designed to be a microcosm of Persian artistry. The complex offers a huge range of facilities, including more than a thousand retail outlets over seven floors, and offers both international brands and local products. The inclusion of the local businesses not only support the domestic economy, but also offers visitors a unique glimpse into Iran's cultural legacy. The mall houses several museums and art galleries that showcase Persian art, history, and culture, serving as a bridge between Iran's past and present. Also, it features a car showroom, a mirror hall based on the Hall of Mirrors at the Goldstown Palace, a garden that covers three floors, and a traditional bazaar. The Iran Mall sets a high standard for leisure and entertainment. The building does also focus on sustainability and environmental conservation in its design. It features a massive roof garden that spans several acres and is one of the largest of its kind in the world. But it also contributes to the city's ecological health by acting as a green lung in the heart of Tehran. There are two extensive convention and exhibition spaces, making it an important venue for international conferences. This will help Tehran be seen as a global meeting point. While all these lofty goals haven't quite yet become a reality, the mall has already supercharged the local economy by attracting visitors and investors from far and wide. Further expansions are now in the planning stage too, meaning that so long as there's the demand, there's no limit to how far it will expand. Thanks for watching everyone, I'll see you next time. Thank you to our channel members.